So I am in Salt Lake City. I don't know the last time I logged in here, <laughs> but um, yeah, I'm in Salt Lake City. So today I had, first of all, let me back up. I haven't been to work in like two weeks. So this is my first trip back since my last trip, which was Dallas in Chicago. And again, that was like two weeks ago. So today, um, my day started at 6.45 a.m. I had to report at 6.45 this morning. Um, so I went from LaGuardia to Houston and then from Houston to Salt Lake City. Um, the first flight was about three hours and change and the second flight was two hours and change. Well, more than change, damn near a dollar. Um, but anyway, I made it. It was, they were, they were short, they weren't short flights. They were decent flight times, but they just felt long. And once service was done, it was like, oh, now what do I do? Um, but whatever, I made it, made it to Salt Lake City. And I am here for about 21, 22 hours. So I'm hanging out at the pool because it's super hot here today. I think it's like 90 degrees. It's not humid at all, it's hot though. I may get in the pool in a minute. It's a few people in there, one too many for my liking. So we'll see, we have it goes. And outside of that, I don't know, the mall is closed today. I was gonna go to the mall, um, but it's closed today because it's Sunday. So I don't know, there's a grocery store here. It's called Harmon, which was pretty decent the last time I was here. I don't know where I'm looking right now because the sun is like in my face. So I don't know, I'm just staring at this point. Um, but yes, I may go to Harmon's, it's a grocery store, just to get some snacks and stuff because, I don't know, it's kind of far. It's not far, but you know, you know, a little bit out of the way. And even not even out of the way, I would have to, I could walk, I'm definitely not doing that. Um, or Uber it, or they have like a train right outside the hotel that I guess I could take there. But who wants to take the train? I don't know, I'll see how I'm feeling. Um, I may or may not go. I may do room service or something quick and simple and just stay at the pool until the very last minute and then do room service. I don't know. I'm going to see what's in the area to eat as well. Um, I wanted to go to the grocery store just to get snacks, but I have nowhere to put them because I didn't bring my big um, lunch bag. I bought a small lunch bag because I only needed food for one day because today I'm in Salt Lake City early enough to where food would be open, whereas tomorrow, um, tomorrow I go to Houston by the way so for tomorrow I have a full day it's three flights um, and I won't have time between flights to get anything to eat and by the time I get into Houston it's gonna be almost midnight okay ladies and gentlemen I am currently in LAX LA um, where the local time is <laughs> so I am in LA right now I just arrived I went from Salt Lake City to Denver and then Denver to LAX. Now from LAX, I go to Houston. Um, the first two flights were easy peasy. First one was super short, less than an hour. The second one was hour and change. Um, but both were pretty easy. So this is the longest one of the day. Um, I don't have the flight time yet, but it'll probably be about two hours and change. And this is the last one. We get in really late. So yeah, so I'm in LA, we are waiting for um, the passengers to board. We have about 10, 15 minutes before boarding. And I went and grabbed something to eat. I will show you. So I'm on a 221 again today. And I'm A as well, if I didn't mention that. So, oh shoot. I went and got whatever this is. Some grilled fish and fries from um, some little food place that's out here that was outside the gate. I was gonna get a sandwich, but I didn't have any idea what kind of sandwich I wanted. So then I saw this. The fish was super small, small piece of grilled fish, and it's some fries. Um, the fish has no flavor whatsoever. But whatever, it's something to eat because I won't um, be able to get anything when I get to the hotel because I'm sure everything will be closed. And the food that I brought with me, my ice packs did not hold up throughout the night last night. I put it in the refrigerator and the refrigerator wasn't that cold. I didn't realize it wasn't that cold until it was too late. So anyway, so I won't have anything to eat, but this will hold me over. 
I'm tempted to eat the food that I brought, but I don't want to get sick. I don't know. I'll see how it goes. But yeah, so I don't know. My crew is cool. I have two guys. They're in the back. They're cool. Hi. Hi. How are you? How are you? I'm good. Thank you. Thank you. Awesome. Thank you. Yes. Beautiful. I know. Right? Right? I'll enjoy the last. Yes. Thank you. Okay. Yeah, she told me that there was no specials and I think like a couple seats open, but so yeah, sorry about that. Um so yeah, so easy crew, super cool. So yeah, I'm just ready to get there at this point. I hope this is an easy flight. I hope no one acts up because you know, LA crowds and then LA to Houston. I don't know. Hope they're hope they're pretty chill. I just made it to Houston. Well, to my room in Houston, rather. It is now 12.42 Houston time, which means it's 1.42 back in New York. Um, the flight was easy, super easy. Everyone was chill um, on the flight, so that was a plus. Um, so, yeah, we're getting in late, but that's fine. Tomorrow we have a late pickup. Our pickup tomorrow will be at... Um, 4 30 um and our flight is at six um but anyway um, i'm gonna do a quick sweep of the room just make sure everything is clean and tidy you know spray everything down with my lysol and then eat something i don't have much again the food that i brought with me it's it's a wrap um i mean i'm gonna open it and see if it smells don't judge me um, i'm gonna see take a little bite see what happens hopefully i don't get sick but I'll be asleep in no time because it's late and I'm tired. Um, so tomorrow I'm going to get up. I'm going to try my best to get up early. I'm going to set up an early alarm. Not early, but decent time. So I can go to the pool because it's so humid. I got here. It's late, obviously, and it was so humid at night. So I can't imagine what it's going to be like tomorrow. Hello, good morning, good afternoon, good evening. Um, so today is day three of my trip and I am ending it here in Houston. I have a few hours here during the day and my flight is at six o'clock this evening. Well, 5.59 to be exact <laughs> is my flight later on. Pickup is at 4.29. So I'm just gonna go hang out at the pool. Like I was saying yesterday, I'm just gonna go hang out at the pool for a bit, get some sun, some good old vitamin D, cause I need it. Um, yeah, get a little tan. Anyway, so yes, yeah, so I'm just waking up. Forgive the hoarseness. Um, what else? That's about it. I guess I will see you at the pool. Normally, I don't wear hats to the pool. I'm not really that girl. Yeah, because I want full sun. I don't. I'm not putting the hat on to block the sun or anything. That's not what I'm doing. So don't get you know misconstrued by that. I need all the sun. Um, but yeah, so let me just put my hat on. See what it looks like. And then I didn't really want to put the hoops on. I love a hoop, but I didn't want a small earring. All the other earrings I have are really tiny. Um, so I was like, you know, just put on hoops, you know, when in doubt, hoops, you know, man cheating on you, hoops. You need to lose weight, hoops. So here we are. So I threw my hoops on, threw my little hat on. When I get to the pool, I will pull my hair up. Um, and that's it, I guess. So I will see you guys at the pool. So I was literally about to walk out. And then, really girl, the house of us, what's happened? So I will show you the pool from here. I don't see the sun, first of all. It's shaped like Texas, if you can't tell. Okay. So I'm at the pool and there is no sun out here. It's actually a little chilly. Not chilly, but yeah, it got, it's a little breeze in the air. Like where, where's the heat and humidity that I felt last night when I arrived? Um, I don't feel that. This sucks. I'm annoyed because where's the sun? Um, yeah, I don't know if you could tell like there's literally no sun out here. I picked a section over here by myself with no one. This is the little view. So 
yes, I'm still sitting here. The sun literally is just coming out. I was gonna go get my nails done, um, like a mani pedi. Well, a full set and a pedi. I was literally about to get up, and the sun. I saw the sun peeking out over behind me a little bit, and now it moved over. Um, so now I'm not sure if I want to go do that. It's hella hot. It's um, at this point it's like 2:20. Um, I went to the lazy river out there. It was cool. It was fun. It was cute. Um, so now I'm about to go back to my room and get ready. It's so hot, but it was cute. I enjoyed my little time. Um, one day I definitely need to see Houston though. Because <laughs> the last time I was here, I did nothing. I went to the gym and now this time I'm just here at the pool and next time I will probably be at the pool. Because I come back again next week if I haven't mentioned that already. Um, so yeah, I need to see this city. Um, I was here years ago, um, not for work, for an event, and it was cool. Um, yeah, I'm just blabbering at this point. I'm kind of blah. I don't know why. I just feel like, I don't know. I feel like I, I didn't waste time, but I just feel like I could have done something um, productive other than lay at the pool. But it's like, what else am I going to do? I don't know anybody here. Is there anybody in Houston out there that wants to spend time with me? <laughs> so, my eyebrows, I just used this one tool. So, we're going to start. Um, just, just vibe with me, folks. So, when I was coming from the pool, this man, this older white man, I'm like, are you trying to get me for my goods, mister? Him and his wife, I saw him, in, or I don't know if it's his wife, but a lady he was with, they were in the pool. So I, as I was going through the lazy river at the pool, um, they were like in my way, right? Well, not in my way, but they were, so I was going under the bridge and under the bridge, water was falling down like a waterfall. So there were spots under the bridge where you can go past and not get wet. And they were standing in the area where I needed to go. So, you know, I said, excuse me or whatever. I'm like, sorry, I don't wanna, you know, <laughs> be in your way, but I can't do two things at once, obviously. I can't do my eyebrows at all. But yeah, I was like, sorry or whatever. I'm trying to pass it, I just don't wanna get my hair wet. And he's like, oh, don't worry, uh. You know, and that was that. So then, at another point, I'm in the pool, and same thing, going past, they're still there. I'm like, what the hell? But they're somewhere else and they seem to be like, hey, so the wife, she was like, come, don't worry. Because they were still in the spot where I need to get past where you don't get wet. Like it's where the waterfall is like, coming down. So the husband like grabs the tube, you know, the little inner tubes, the brown donut looking things. He grabs it, the thing that I'm on as if he's going to push me under it, but jokingly. And she was like, oh, no, and they're both laughing. And I laughed a little bit, but, you know, it was cool. Because, you know, we're all here trying to have a good time, just enjoy. So it was fine. Under normal circumstances, probably would have got cursed out. But, you know, it was fine. So whatever. So as I'm leaving the pool area, he walks by. And he's like, oh, hey, you're leaving, huh? And I'm like, yeah, it's time for me to go. He's like, yeah, because you've been out here. For a while since the sun was over there. I remember when I was saying earlier when I first got there how it was um the sun wasn't really out. So he was like, Yeah, you've been here since the sun was over there. And I was like, Yeah, I know, so it's time for me to go now. I've been out here, I got enough. So then he goes to get a towel and then he's walking back and he comes behind me. He grabs my shoulder, he's like, I know you wanna cool off, something, something, and then he comes over here and whispers something. I don't know what, something about being cool. I don't know, he was like mumbling, but like this close. Like right here, like sorry. Mumbles whatever, he's like, okay, well, you enjoy. I was like, hey, bye, enjoy your day. He was like, enjoy the rest of your day too. Stay beautiful, stay beautiful. But the way he said it was like. <laughs> I'm like, 
Hey yo, what is going on? gonna do like a little cute review but I'm like do the people want that <laughs> that's my alarm girl time to go <laughs> it's 4 15 it's time to go so yeah these earrings are from Majori I love them um I wanted something small dainty but bold and I feel like these are them I really like them. But anyway, I'm gonna go. Okay. <laughs> Hey, hello. So I have a few errands to run. I have to take Oreo to the groomer. She's here. I need to go to Nordstrom and return some stuff. Um, I want to get a massage and mani pedi and I don't know a few other things. So let's roll. Is this what you want now? Feels like you're looking for something better. Trying to find something cute for the winter and fall. So we'll see what I can find. Don't know if I want to purchase today, but we'll see. I'm gonna go look at some intimate apparel. I need some new panties. Um, still in Nordstrom, obviously. But the shoes I was looking at, um, the ADOX, the Louboutins, I've wanted those for years. So. But I want something for every day. So that's why I was looking at the other pair. But I just wasn't feeling them. It was just weird looking. It gave me witch vibes. But, I don't know. Let's see. Ooh, lingerie, my favorite. This is what I want now. No, I won't settle for anything else. these cute um tops one is they're all bodysuits but um they're all bodysuits I don't know which one and so cute the panties and bras did not work out and it's not a big selection over there so as I was walking out I saw these and I'm like oh those are cute let me try them on go, go, go. appointment um she's just finishing up another girl so i am i'm just waiting around till she's done oh my gosh i just finished getting my lashes done that took forever like so now i'm gonna go meet my sister and my niece and hang out with them for a bit get some starbucks something to eat focus, I just need to focus. 